so I was going to end here, uh, but a, a couple of days ago I met some people in Mexico City, some real Miku fans, and they told me about uh, Mexican fans who made uh, music and vocabulary with, with Hatsune Miku for quite a long time, and I didn't know anything about that. And they showed me some videos, and I found it was so great. So I decided I have to, sh to show them here. So I don't know, maybe you all know them. Maybe I'm the only one here who doesn't know about it. But uh, there's a group called Maobox. I'm sure they're not the only one. I'm sure it's just that that's the one I heard about. Uh, but they make uh, videos and music in Spanish with Vocaloid. And I don't know Spanish, but it sounded pretty much like Spanish to me. I just want to know how many of you knew that that video. Ah, uh, of course. <laughs> okay, so if you, because with the noise probably you didn't hear the lyrics, but go online and try to listen to it. It's very funny. It's really exactly what Hatsune Miku was about at the beginning. It's uh, the internet culture, some references, some kind of private jokes. It's about a guy probably probably in Japan who used to post messages on, on, on uh, Nico Nico Doga in Spanish, but it was bad Spanish, I mean some wrong uh, spelling or something. And so they make jokes about that and they have the whole uh, Krypton team talking about that. So I also heard some music, some salsa made with vocaloids that was really excellent. So I'm really happy to see that uh, there are some fans in Mexico who have been using the software and making things uh, without our knowledge. And uh, that's really what we want to encourage.